Storm Trucker weather starts now with Chief Meteorologist Ryan Dennis. Welcome back, everyone. It is definitely warm outside right now. As temperatures are currently in the mid to upper 70s and low to mid 80s in most locations. On the Opportunity Bank ICANN, we have had partly cloudy skies throughout the day today. And some of you from the Helena area may have been able to see some smoke today. So there is a prescribed burn going on. You can see that smoke and the smoke plume on our Opportunity Bank camera. Taking a look at satellite and radar this morning, it was mainly dry, but throughout the afternoon and so far this evening, there have been a few scattered showers and storms, especially within central and north central Montana, as well as southwestern Montana. And this precipitation is associated with a disturbance that is going to be working its way through Montana as we go through this evening and into tonight. And then Working its way into the Pacific Northwest right now is another disturbance with a cold front, and that will pass through Montana as we go through tomorrow, giving us another chance to see some scattered showers and thunderstorms, especially in locations east of I-15. That cold front is also going to allow the wind to pick up a little bit, and it will cool the temperatures down a little bit as we head into tomorrow and Thursday. For this evening and tonight, there are going to be some scattered showers and thunderstorms around as that disturbance works its way through our area. We're also going to have partly to mostly cloudy skies overnight tonight. And then for your date tomorrow, we are going to have partly cloudy skies and it will be a little bit cloudier during the morning and then a little bit sunnier during the afternoon and the evening. During the morning, a few showers and thunderstorms are possible in eastern and south central Montana. And then as we head into Wednesday afternoon and evening, that's when a few scattered showers and thunderstorms are possible in central and north central Montana, including around Great Falls and around Helena. Heading into tomorrow night, we are going to have clearing skies from west to east, and the precipitation will work its way out of the state as well. And then very nice weather is expected on Thursday. A lot of the state is going to be dry with mostly sunny skies, but could see a few more showers and thunderstorms in northeast. Montana. Tonight, we're just going to have a light breeze in most locations. The one exception will be along the Rocky Mountain front where the wind is going to increase as we go through tonight. And then for tomorrow, after that cold front passes through, it is going to be a bit breezy. Sustained wind speeds are going to be between 10 and 20 miles per hour. And wind gusts over 30 miles per hour are going to be possible at times. And that wind will be coming out of the west or the west-northwest in most spots. The wind then dies down as we head into tomorrow night. And we just are going to have a light breeze around as we head into Thursday. Now for tonight, low temperatures are going to be in the upper 40s and low to mid 50s in most locations. So it is going to be a cool night. And again, there will be some scattered showers and thunderstorms tonight. And then for your day tomorrow, partly cloudy skies, a chance of showers and thunderstorms, and it will be cooler than it was today. High temperatures back down into the 70s for most of us. A few spots will only top out in the upper 60s. Very nice weather on Thursday, mainly sunny and highs in the 70s for most of us. Friday and this weekend, plenty of sunshine, dry conditions, and it will be warm with highs in the upper 70s and low to mid 80s. Monday, mostly sunny in 81, and then a lot cooler next Tuesday. Highs back in the 60s with a chance of showers and thunderstorms as a strong cold front works its way through Montana. In Great Falls, a chance of showers and thunderstorms tonight and tomorrow. High of 77 tomorrow, mostly sunny in 75 on Thursday, and then sunny and warm for Friday and this upcoming weekend.